Wow, it's a very windy day. I wonder what Puppy is doing on such a windy day. I'll just rake up these leaves before I search for Puppy. Speed! We are going to build an anemometer. My teacher showed me. There! Now I stick the cups on. Two done! Two more to go! <laughs> now just a pen to hold it together. It spins! But we need a timer. Wait here. hold the wind meter in the wind and count how many times it spins in one minute. <laughs> okay, okay, puppy. Let me explain. We will find out if the wind is light, moderate, strong or gale force. <laughs> count with me, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. 30 turns in one minute. That is a moderate wind. <laughs> I know. It feels like a gale force wind. Aha. I hear something. Can you guess? That's right. It's talking drum. Hi, Jabu. How are you today? Hello, Talking Drum. I'm very good. Puppy and I built a wind meter. Ah, an anemometer. Yes, you know everything, Talking Drum. Well, we have a rescue mission and it was caused by a gale force wind. Wow, that would make the cup spin like a helicopter. Yes, the anemometer would spin more than 60 times in 60 seconds. But take a look, Jabu. The pal's fishing owls were sleeping on a branch when a gale force wind snapped it and trapped owl's claw underneath. The poor owl. I hope the trapped one's claw is not hurt too badly. I believe his claw is fine. It is just stuck. But we better hurry. Yes, let's go. Which way to go? I know the Pell's fishing owls live on an island in the river Delta, but I am not sure of the way. Maybe we should drum. Someone 
might come to help us on our way. No, 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 no drumming. It gives me a headache. Hello, Van. Can you help us? We're on a rescue mission to help Pearl's fishing owl. Well, let me think. Mm, no, <laughs> I don't give a hoot for the owl. <laughs> Get it? I, I don't give a hoot, hoot, hoot for the owl. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Who's your boy? I am Van the Vulture. A fierce, brave bird of land and sky. I am glad you have so much self-worth, Van. But that is not what Jabu meant. <laughs> then what did he mean? He was tired of you joking instead of helping. <laughs> I won't help. The owl is no pal of mine. <laughs> Pal's owl is no pal of mine. <laughs> Van! His claw is trapped under a branch. And you are stuck at a branch in the road. <laughs> a branch in the road. <laughs> you really are a hoot today, Van. Oh, trying to be funny? Jabu, let's drum. I am sure we will find someone to help. Right away, talking drum. The noisy boy and noisy drum give me no peace and quiet. I'd rather be owl by myself. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> uh, owl by myself. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Drum with me. On a table. On your legs. Or on a magical drum. Let's play some more. Louder and faster now. I don't see anyone. Me neither. It is because I am not anyone. I am Jack the African Hare, a master of disguise. It's a humble but useful talent that has helped to ensure the survival of our species for centuries. And you are? Hello, Jack the African Hare. I'm Jabu, and this is my magical talking drum. It's nice to meet you, too. Oh, my dear boy, the pleasure is all mine. I have not come across a homo sapien in years. What's that? A human, Jabu. Humans are from the species Homo sapiens. It is Latin for wise man. Oh, <laughs> and there I thought I was just a boy. Never put yourself down. You are not just a boy. You are Jabu from the jungle. Jack Hare is right, Jabu. You need to be proud of who you are. All humans and animals are special. Okay, but we need help to save Pearl's fishing owl. Ooh, quite a rare bird. I have not spotted one in years. He lives on an island in the River Delta. Do you know the way? Tricky, but usually I just follow my nose, like this. <gasps> are you okay, Jack the Hare? Ha! Tricked you! Tricked you! <laughs> <laughs> yes, you really did. I got it from my father, Jack, and his father, Jack, and his father, Jack, and so on. I come from a long line of tricksters. <laughs> so you are a bit of a joker, Jack. Yes, Jabu. According to legend, he has loved playing tricks. But we have to get going. Yes, but which way? <laughs> this way. Ooh, it smells like... Water and something I love. Great. You have a useful superpower. Indeed. And I have a few more up my sleeve. <laughs> if you want to be my friend, just smile and say hello. Come along and have fun with me. There's so many places to go. Singing songs. Jack. Well, all male African hares are known as the Jack. 
Yes, and all female African hares are known as a jill. Wow, don't you get confused at gatherings? Well, not really. Look at me. Would you confuse me with another jack? Woohoo! <laughs> no, you have a good point. All people and animals are unique, Jabu, no matter what we call them. That reminds me, I am very fast. So I'm going to hop along and do some uh, stuff on the way. Sure, Jeff. See you at the River Delta. Phew, he is fast. Pears can run up to 70 kilometers per hour, Jabu. Wow, another superpower up his sleeve. Out into the beautiful world. Out into the beautiful world. Come on, all you boys and girls. We're off to see the beautiful world. Out into the beautiful world. Out into the beautiful world. Come on, all you boys and girls. We're off to see the beautiful world. This river delta is beautiful. Yes, wonderful, Jabu. But I wonder where Jack the Hare is. I'll play some notes. Maybe he will hear us. Yes, please, Jabu. <clears throat> it won't work. The Hare won't hear you. <laughs> How can you be so sure, man? Because he left you all by yourself. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> hare left you all by yourselves. <laughs> Fan. What do you mean? Let's just say the hare is not dying to see you. <laughs> Van, if Jack the Hare is hurt, you better show us. It's no time for jokes. Fine. Follow me. But I hate being the bearer of bad news. Oh no! He looks hurt. It looks like... Jack the Hare was hare today, but gone to tomorrow. <laughs> How can you joke about this? Mm -hmm. Because I don't give a hoot. <laughs> I don't give a hoot for an owl or a hare. <laughs> Jack is just sleeping off the berries he ate on the way here. I have a plan. Got you. Jackie's heartbeat fan, maybe there's still hope. Poor scared boy. Not so noisy now, eh? Fan the fearless vulture will help. <coughs> uh, mm, still warm? Those berries must be very soporific. Yes. The berries made him very sleepy. Oh, brave Van. Please put your head on his chest, just to make sure. Uh, 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 <clears throat> I suppose I am the bravest one around here. <laughs> it's alive! It's alive! <laughs> That vile vulture thought I was a nibble, a scrap of food. <laughs> <laughs> was that hair raising Jack? Tricked you and tricked Van. <laughs> I take my hat off to you. You tricked one of the best and got rid of a vile vulture. Indeed. But now we must find a way to get to Fishing Owl's Island. know which island to go to. Well, I do have a few more superpowers up my sleeve. What superpower can help us, Jack? Super sensitive hearing, young Jabu. Let me listen. Hmm, you say it's Pell's fishing owl? Yes, he lives on an island with his partner. Hmm, there's a bit of interference, but I judge they're about... Two nautical miles south of here. What's a nautical mile? You measure distance on water in nautical miles, Jabu. 
One nautical mile is almost two kilometers in land distance. Phew! So the island is about four kilometers away. How will we get there? There should be a rowing boat tied up in the reeds over there. The boat is gone. I suspect foul play. It was here earlier. It's about time you realized you've been tricked. <laughs> about time. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Van, we need the boat to rescue Fishing Owl. Oh, did I barge in on your rescue mission? <laughs> barge in. <laughs> if I was you, I'd get that little ship to shore soonest. You look like a sitting duck. <laughs> I'm not scared of a little bit of water. But you might be of a... Crocodile! Ah! Help! Help! <laughs> that was scary! <laughs> wow! How did you know about the crocodile? A combination of luck and good timing, Jabu. Crocodile and I go way back. We are going to need a lot of luck to get to Fishing Owl. Don't worry, Magic Drum. I have a few more superpowers up my sleeve. Yay! What is it, Jack the Hare? My front teeth never stop growing. Okay. And how will that help us? I have to gnaw at things to keep them from getting too long. Well, but you can't gnaw our way to the island. Well, actually I can. You can? I can chip out a sturdy makoro in... Uh, well, I'm not sure how long it'll take. A makoro? It is a traditional African canoe that is used on the River Delta, Jabu. I will show you. This wood is hard. Drum up some beats to keep me going, Jabu. <sighs> Any time, Jack. As long as it will get us to Fishing Owl. It must also keep my skin dry. I don't like water, Jack the Hare. Of course. I'm on it. Don't want to disturb the wildlife. Seems I will need reinforcements. But who can we ask? As I said, I come from a large family of Jack and Jill hares. Leave it to me. I called for Jack, Jack, Jill, and Jill. They will be here shortly. By tapping your feet on the ground. Hares send warning signals to each other by tapping their paws on the ground, Jabu. That is so cool. <laughs> Jabu, can you and Magic Drum please find a long stick to push the Makora along? I will wait here for the family. Right away, Chak the Hare. Time is running out to get to Owl. Wow! That was super fast! But where did all the hairs go? You know what they say. Hair today, gone tomorrow. <laughs> All aboard now! Let's go! Yes, we must hurry. Just keep me dry. <laughs> this is fun! I know what will make it more fun. A little song. Join in at any time. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down to Owl. When you see a crocodile, don't forget to scream. Ah! <laughs> Sing with me, Jabu! Row, 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 row your, boat your boat gently down, down the stream. stream. Merrily, 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 life is but, but a dream. dream. Row, 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 row your, your boat gently, gently down, down to owl. owl. When, when you see a crocodile, don't, don't forget, forget to scream. And all together! Aye, aye, Captain here. Row, 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 row your boat gently, gently down, the down the stream. When, when you see, see a crocodile, don't, don't forget, forget to scream. To scream. Ah!
Look, we made it. Thank goodness. Jabu, can you lift the branch of Fishing Owl's Claw? I think so. All that Makoro pushing gave me a few extra muscles. Soon you will be a strong man, Jabu. I hope so. Don't worry, Owl. Soon you will be free to go fishing with your partner. <coughs> Well done, fishing owl. Happy fishing, fishing owls. Well, it's time for me to catch up with Jack and Jill Hare. They happen to live here on the island. Enjoy, Jack. Thanks for helping. I hope to see you again, Jack the Hare. You will. But until then, remember, Every boy, girl, and animal in this world are special. And when you see a crocodile, don't forget to scream. <laughs> Bye, Jabu and Magic Drum. <laughs> Bye, Jack the Hare. Bye, Jack the Hare. It's time to go, Jabu. Goodbye, everybody. See you soon. Goodbye, all.